Steve Blass. I guess you liked him on there. I'm sorry. Runner goes. Cervelli throws it down, and Castro's in. Did he overslide? No. Well, Castro with a stolen base, his fifth of the year. Yeah, it just uh, it, it just looked like a setup. They're not doing much. They're not cashing in and, and trying to get 90 feet. Clint Hurdle is coming out. Looks like he wants to challenge this. So Clint's going to use a challenge here. Feels as though Castro is plenty safe, but did he take his foot up off the bag or not? It, well, that, that lead foot certainly went beyond, and then did he drag the, the back foot over on top of the base? Was there a point when he was off the bag and the glove ooh, was on him? Ooh, ooh. Maybe there. We've, we've got a we've got an argument. Let's put it that way. So Jim Joyce, the crew chief. And the, this would be huge. Second base umpire over there. The headsets back to New York. Looked like a routine uh, steal by Castro, but well, these guys are go all going a lot. Now, I should, should say oh, a lot of them are going past the bag with that front foot and then uh, maintaining contact until the other foot catches up. Plenty of time. But front foot. Look at the back foot now. Front foot's gone. Right there, close, very close. He's tagging him up on the upper upper leg. So where is that back foot? When is that making contact? So I'm going to say we got a 60 percent of winning this challenge. 60 percent. Well, depending on the angles they're looking at in New York, it's very close. And because it was called safe, if they can't come up with clear and convincing evidence, it'll be uh, they call that would stand. You know, I just hope that that wire is plugged in and they're just not talking it over and deciding on their own. <laughs> I know there was one yesterday that folks are still talking about. There's some conversation about it this morning. Let's see, this might show us. Okay, he's off the bag there and he gets tagged. Well, it looks like he gets tagged there before that back foot hits the bag. So he may be out. But we'll see what folks in New York determine. This is a, I understand the concept. This is the part I don't like. Major League ball game. Everybody standing out. One nothing ball game. Well, yesterday Just standing around in the third inning. Steve Dexter Fowler trying to steal second base and. He was called out. Joe Madden challenged it. It was very close, and they couldn't come up with anything that would overturn the call. And one angle showed he was out. One angle showed he was safe, and so they let the call stand that he was out by the call. You know, as a pitcher like AJ, I would hate standing around. I'm, I'm trying to stay in some kind of a, a routine, a rhythm, a flow, and uh, you know, good, bad, or indifferent on the call. You hate to see your guy having to stand around. Typically, the ones that are reviewed long like this don't get overturned much. This is all. The review yesterday was three hours. Uh, three hours. Well, it seemed like three hours. Three minutes and five seconds on the review yesterday. I don't know where we are right now. Joe Madden a little upset with this right now that it's even being challenged, but the Pirates saw something. They saw it quickly, and Clint Hurdle was out of the dugout pretty quickly and asked for the challenge. Okay, here we go. What do we have, gentlemen? He's out. The call has been overturned. Wow. Wow. Back foot didn't make it in time after the front foot went by. See, there, there's the thing about over, over sliding that front foot. If that's there. I mean, you're, you're automatically safe. Now, why would you slide beyond it? To get that back foot into play. He was off the bag right there when Jung Ho tags him just before that back foot hits the bag. The Allegheny Health Network Supermo is showing us right there. 